he's got a really Coach Jeff Rutledge always has his eye on potential. He says students with disabilities have a special spark. To feel a sense of belonging, uh, to feel like they are accepted by their peers, by their classmates, by their teammates, it's uh, very important to me, I think. Rutledge coaches football and basketball at Hubbardville High School, despite living with a disability of his own. He's been deaf since he was two years old. Rutledge played sports as a child and was given a fair shot to play on a traditional team. I'm thankful you know, that I had coaches who were, who were willing to work with me. Today, the U.S. Department of Education is mandating schools make reasonable modifications for students with disabilities or create separate leagues just for them. Rutledge says no matter what, safety must come first, not only for the athlete with the disability, but for the opponents and team members as well. Hearing loss myself, you know, there probably may have been a potential risk of, you know, me uh, late hitting someone on the other team by not hearing the whistle and the play stop and maybe I continue forward and, and tackle the opponent. Like out there on the court, especially if they're in a wheelchair, you have to like you just have to be very careful and watch what you're doing. Although Rutledge did not get to hear the cheers from the stadium, he tackled his disability. I'm a great basketball player. And he hopes young athletes like Donnie are also given the chance to become shining stars. Good job, Donnie. In Fayette, Melissa Crabtree, CBS 42 News.